A sprite event is like a switch that turns on an electric current in the space between the Earth and the ionosphere. In fact, our planet is surrounded by electric current from the surface to the edge of space. Like lightning, sprites help to complete a global circuit. It's kind of confusing to the eye because it doesn't make sense. But yes, water is affected by a magnet. Water will avoid the magnet and pull away from it. And there you have. I can't believe the lighting really shows that. Here is, uh, this is basically rot rotating uh, counterclockwise. The other video is uh, clip was showing clockwise rotation. Uh, it's absolutely incredible. And uh, I hopefully, uh, hopefully you'll be able to duplicate this. It's basically a very simple electrolyzer uh, that can show this effect. Here, and I reverse the polarity of the magnet. I flipped it upside down and I apply a voltage to it. When I apply a voltage, the helical field is basically spinning clockwise in this area. And um, I have a uh, description of why this, uh, this is shown. Uh, it goes back to the 1980s to, an, to a man named Howard Johnson. This is an iron slug here to show to my critics that in fact that uh, the helical field is generated by a magnetic field as opposed to a left and right hand rule of current flow through the wire. Remember, north is never up in the sky, so hold your compass nice and flat. North is never up North in the sky. Is never up in the sky. So hold your compass nice and flat. To the oxygen. Electricity is heat, light, and cold. That since Dr. Franklin and later on Mr. Quetelet conclusively proved the existence of positive electricity within within the atmosphere. Faraday, on the other hand, discovered the magnetic properties of it, as also of one of its component gases, oxygen. And that this gas, when cool, exerts a greater magnetic influence than when it is heated. We can thus reasonably assume that the cold frozen currents above, in addition to holding positive electricity, exert a powerful magnetic influence on everything they surround. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video presentation. If you did, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, like the video, and share it on your favorite social media sites. There's a lot more to come, so stay tuned, and we'll see you back next time.